location, location, location presenter Kirsty Alsop took to social media today to slam Tory MPs for attacking each other on social media ahead of the no confidence vote in Boris Johnson. The star pointed out that the politicians had not been voted in on our dime to participate in some very public infighting. Kirsty, 50, shared her views with her 427,700 Twitter followers this afternoon. Dear Tory MPs, Kirsty penned. You were not voted into Parliament to spend your time, on our dime, attacking each other on social media. Get a BY grip, the presenter added defiantly. Kirsty's followers took to the comment section to share their thoughts on the development so far ahead of the vote, which will be held at 6 p.m. today. Xanthi Grace wrote, I think it's fascinating to see the real viciousness of politics being played out. It's a dirty business and behind all the false smiles and weasel words stalks a thirst for power. They are mostly in it for that end. It's not often we see glimpses of the reality of politics. Nanozoid added, they prioritize power over plan or policy. It makes me fear for our future. Steve penned, it's a sad indictment of how this government operates. We are enabling incompetence at a time when so much needs repairing. It just isn't good enough and long past being acceptable. Tory infighting has already erupted in the public eye today, with Nadine Dorries at the center. Former Health Secretary Jeremy Hunt's announcement that he will vote to oust Boris Johnson this evening sparked a fierce backlash from the Culture Secretary. She publicly attacked the senior Tory official, who has said the Tory party is failing to offer the British people the integrity, competence and vision necessary to unleash the enormous potential of our country. Nadine blasted the former health secretary's handling of the pandemic, suggesting it spoke of wider judgment failures. She tweeted. Your pandemic preparation during six years as health secretary was found wanting and inadequate. Your duplicity right now in destabilizing the party and country to serve your own personal ambition, more so. You've been wrong about almost everything, you are wrong again now. The no-confidence vote in the Prime Minister will take place between 6 p.m. and 8 p.m. this evening in the House of Commons. An announcement is expected about an hour after the vote closes.